In today's Weather Why, we're going to be talking about how Hispaniola and Cuba protect Florida from tropical storms and hurricanes. In fact, uh, th those islands act as a barrier oftentimes when we see tropical storms, even tropical waves as well. Once they approach Hispaniola and Cuba, oftentimes while they may be strong when they enter that area, they are much weaker as they exit. It acts almost like a barrier. Why does that happen, especially with Hispaniola? Well, Hispaniola is a very rugged um, uh, island. In fact, the Cordillera Central, which is in the central and eastern part of the island and covers most of Hispaniola, has one of the highest peaks in the world. The 16th highest peak, over 10,000, that's Duarte Peak, is within the Cordillera Central. And those mountain ranges severely disrupt tropical storms, hurricanes, and tropical waves. It disrupts the circulation. Now, the track is important as well because the farther north track, you have less interaction. Meanwhile, if you do have a track coming over or south of Hispaniola, oftentimes those tropical storms, they almost always, tropical storms and hurricanes will weaken. Now, a tropical wave or even a, a tropical rainstorm can also weaken as well. But if that system goes north of Hispaniola, that's a totally separate uh, track that would tend to strengthen. But again, it is Hispaniola and Cuba because of the terrain and the interaction these tropical systems has with those land masses, they tend to be much weaker as they leave that area than when they entered it. And now you know.